Right, I'm joined with Mark Chintalanga this evening. Thanks for, for joining us. No stress. <laughs> um, two days here against Gloucester. What are your thoughts at the end of that final day? Um, I thought it was a good exercise to start off with. Uh, obviously, we're building towards the season. Um, we're preparing in a way, um, trying to let guys feel the rhythm and feel, from a bowling aspect, feel themselves um, settling in in an over or settling in in a spell. Um, batters slightly different, you know, they've got stuff to work on technique wise and also getting bat on ball and settling in. But otherwise, I think it's a, it's a really good exercise. And for yourself, uh, a first unofficial Somerset wicket uh, this morning, a, a not a bad delivery <laughs> to, to get it with. How did you feel about no, it? No, I love it, love it. Um, hopefully there's many more to come, official ones. Mm -hmm. um, but to be fair, yeah, I take that first one. It's always nice to get, to get on the board. But at the same time, you know, like I spoke to the coach as well and we're just going through the processes and make sure that we're ready once, uh, once the, the, first, the, the first game is around the corner, once it starts. Um, so it's like building up slowly, uh, getting there and just trying to get some miles in the legs. Um, obviously these warm-up games are, are quite, um, it, they quite play on a, we try to play on a, on a competitive level at the same time. But you're also experimenting a little bit with um, skills that you try to work on off season. So yeah, it's a good, it's a good challenge. Good challenge. How beneficial is it to have these preseason gigs? There's a lot of them this year. We've got another yeah. one tomorrow, and then followed in two, two, three days next week. That must be, give you real um, momentum going into to that first game. I feel 100% right. I feel like in general, it's always good. It's always good to get a couple of, like I said, miles on their legs firstly, and then trying to own your skills. You know, uh, you don't want to feel uh, rushed or un underprepared when the first proper season game starts. So um, I feel like these warm-up games are really important in a way. You know, it gets it gets the body going. It makes sure that you're ready for the season coming. And tomorrow, uh, heading up to, to Bristol um, to, uh, to change formats, play a couple of T20s. Yeah, a little bit different. <laughs> to be fair, um, yeah, it's, it's always it's a different challenge straight away. Uh, you knew, you're moving from the longer format straight into something short, uh, which is exciting at the same time. And also, like, it all comes down to skills as well, like uh, trying to hit back of a length or a good length in four-day cricket. All of a sudden, change straight to Yorkers and slower balls and one bumper stuff like that so it's it's also it brings a different element to the game and i think it, as modern cricketers we we need to be ready to be adaptable in, in a way um because that that's what happens that was happened do, th during uh, throughout the year you get these challenges thrown at you and you must be ready straight away Brilliant. well thank you for joining us no March, and uh, good luck tomorrow thanks so much appreciate it thank you